Okay, maybe it's because we're on the road all the time, but I've gotten to where I love shopping online. The stores never close, I don't have to tie anything to the roof, and I never have to stand in line. But as convenient as shopping online is, there's nothing to beat the charm of browsing a local flea market. We do a lot of that too. This week, we're looking for Texas Best. Nowhere else can you find antiques, handmade crafts, and fine art all within a short walk of each other. Flea markets appeal to the treasure hunter in all of us. That perfect item could be just around the corner where real face-to-face -face human interaction is the only way to buy it. You can meet the very person who crafted your purchase and even haggle for a bargain for the full experience. So where can you find a local flea market that won't leave you feeling short-changed? Where is Texas' best flea market? Well, the votes are in, so let's count them down. Third place this week goes to the Round Top Antiques Fair. Twice a year, antique vendors from all over the country set up in the fields near Round Top and Warrington. The Antiques Fair isn't run by any single person or group. Instead, it's an informal collection of dozens of shows and events. The fair lasts for about 10 days, and even though antiques are the main draw, arts, crafts, and food can all be found in abundance. Your next choice is in the central Texas town of Schertz. Bussy's Flea Market sits just a few blocks off I-35, where customers from San Antonio and Austin can easily drop by. Unlike the other two markets on our list, Bussy's is open every single weekend. This family-owned market has grown to more than 500 booths, most of them covered under permanent pavilions. And coming in first place is the mother of all flea markets, First Monday Trade Days in Canton. This is one of the largest and oldest markets in the country, with up to 100,000 shoppers in attendance. The tradition started back in the 1850s when district court was held in Canton once a month. Traders and shoppers would do business while waiting for their cases to be heard. Now people come just for this historic market, which has moved to a 100-acre plot on the edge of town. It's taken on a life all its own, and that's why you declared First Monday to be Texas' best flea market. 